think about it too much. It's nice knowing we've got the baseball still ahead, so you don't do too much uh, thinking about this uh, being the last one. Most of the regular guys. Excuse me. Most of the regular guys. Yeah, we got some guys that. Uh, yeah, once again, just stuck with that plan from the beginning. Of what do you guys need to to be ready for Thursday? You guys let us know. We're gonna go out there and compete with what we got. What's the thought behind giving David both days off, and essentially five days between games? Here? Yeah, just uh, get his body a rest. That's. Uh, we all decided together what was going to be best for each guy, and some of it's playing more, some of it's playing less. Well, why is it less with him, though? It's, he's not dealing with anything physically. Is it just something you've seen through the course of the season? Just once again, the same. It's just he needed, he felt that those days would be better. Some of it's, you know, is where he feels that he is right now in the swing. Of, and, uh, so we've been listening to him. You know, a lot of the, the guys are very excited. Jake is making a start today, but how did you kind of weigh? Because maybe the sign of respect was for Pistons start versus there's still home field advantage out there to be had and he hasn't pitched in a while. Well, he'll be going out, but we'll also have uh, quite a few other guys are going to be coming in here also who are just going to compete. You got to look at what we potentially were going to do otherwise was have uh, Joe pitch yesterday and, and uh, maybe miss Wayno altogether. Um, so it would have been somebody else jumping in. Um, so we're happy to get Jake out there, and Joe be right behind him, and uh, get everybody else the work that they need to get ready for Thursday. Also, you know, and, and we're not losing sight of the fact. We don't deny that. Uh, yeah, we're trying. We're trying to win, but we've got to keep our keep our priorities right. If I